What's up everyone? Today we're going to take a look at the new Middleton area. It is up and coming. I do want to point out the Packers won and both the Bucks and the Cardinals lost. So the Packers are in first place. Just saying. Anyways, uh, we're going to take a look at the Middleton area. There's a lot going on out there and I'm going to point out a few things like where the elementary school and high school are going. Also the square. Uh, so that'll be interesting. Uh, a lot of new new construction out there so let's get into it all right so we're going to start off to the west of middleton this is the continuing the dream we're going to head east over the new area this is where central parkway and um which was 470 it's be, being rerouted through this area i will show you a couple different places for this uh, you can see the road actually right here and it cuts through and there's something pretty interesting that uh, i don't know if i've shown it on my channel before but you will you'll see it coming up pretty soon it's one of the golf cart tunnels and uh, i know i've seen them being put in before but i don't think i've ever actually captured it on video there's actually three of them in this video so you'll be able to take a peek at all of those and you can kind of see it in the background there but this is where central parkway will come off of 470 it's going to be rerouted you can see the path here going through and then later in the video i'm going to show you where that school and the new square if you don't know middleton is actually the new area where the employees of the villages are going to be so with the continuing the dream, what they wanted to uh, put into place, obviously with the villages growing like it is, they can't have areas uh, without employees and people to work within the villages. This is going to be that area for the villages. It's a close up shot actually of the golf cart tunnel. So this will be filled in and the golf carts will drive through. This will go underneath Central Parkway. Um, if you've been through the villages lately, you know that to get from one side to the other by car is probably close to an hour at this point. And so travel between uh, the distance and actually having a school for uh, the local village kids and, and residents in that area uh, is tough. Now, this is where... Uh, Central Parkway is actually going to connect to 470, we'll come off 470 there. Now this is directly south of Coleman Federal Prison, which is just north of 470 currently uh, from where we're at. And you can see they're still bringing in a lot of the plumbing pipes and drainage pipes and sewer um, also gas that's going to be coming into this area. I was told before that the purple are gas pipes. And they're, they're still bringing a lot of that. They're still doing a lot of uh, construction to bring 470 the way they want it and turn it into Central Parkway. You'll see a lot of that, especially up here in the distance. You're going to see uh, the water. I which I believe is a water treatment plant. Now, none of my videos um, don't go by my word. I'm just telling you what I've seen before and what typically the villages does, in my opinion. Uh, they're not facts. So I don't work for the villages, just so everyone knows that right off the bat. A lot of this stuff will be done. Uh, they're planning on Middleton being completed in 2022. And with a lot of the work that's going on now, it's been pretty interesting to see this area already start to develop. You can see where they're putting in some of the roads and then the piping as well for water and uh, water run runoff slash retention um, along with the gas lines. Now this area here is where it will go north to Baxley Bridge 
and across through Marsh Bend Trail up into Bradford Hawkins, that area. It will cross the Florida Turnpike. And you can see here where uh, Central Parkway actually curves back into 470 or what, what was 470 and renamed. This is that water treatment plant that I was talking about. It looks like that's what they're building. Again, I'm not positive on that. I can't uh, say for sure that's what that is, but it definitely looks like it. This road actually goes all the way out across the Florida Turnpike and out by Newell and the new area close to Leesburg that they're working on. I did some videos out there that I'll put up later this week. You can see one of the roads here getting cut out and cut through. This video was done on a Sunday before the Packer game, of course. I didn't want to miss that. And then uh, the really cool stuff is actually coming up here where you have the elementary school, the high school, and this area is actually where the square is going to be or where I believe it's going to be again I can't be 100% certain but based off the maps that the villages put out and the way the roads look along with the building layouts here I believe that some of these areas are looking to be the elementary and middle school along with the areas that look to be uh, the town square. You can see the parking lots are obviously out there. A couple more golf cart tunnels that the roads will go over major areas. And we're headed back east. I'm just just kidding. We're coming from the east headed back west and you can see this area here is where the elementary slash high school and all of those places will be. So you're gonna have several areas where in here you can walk through, shop. This is supposed to be for the, I'm doing air quotes, younger generation of villagers uh, and their families that actually live and work in the area. So they're supposed to be outdoor shopping and actually um, like a nightlife, uh, if you will. But we'll see how that turns out. I think the only place that they have currently uh, would be Margarita Republic in Spanish Springs. I found this pretty interesting. I've never seen a building layout like this where they have the yellow down. I'm not even sure what that is, to be honest with you. If you know what that is, let me know in the comments. I'm going to outline these for you. I do believe that this is the elementary school. Uh, elementary, middle school. The high school will be off to the right, but they didn't have that laid out yet. And then the square will be right behind it. I'd like to know your thoughts on this area. While we wrap up the video, Leave a comment on what you think of Middleton and the continuing the dream here. I'd really like to hear what you think about the new area and the new design about what they're trying to do here. And I will see you in the next one.